Hi, welcome and hope you're doing well. Here I have the Dell laptop with a cracked screen and in this video I'll be doing a step-by-step -step on how to replace the uh, the LCD screen. So uh, let me turn it around and show you the model number at the back of the laptop. So the model here is P75F. This is a Dell Inspiron 3593. Um, the full model here is P75F013 and the year of manufacturer is year 2020 okay so as you can see this is how it looks like the back of it and this is the front of the laptop and this is how the keyboard the internal part is how it looks like now here if you take a look at it the bezel has no screw that holds onto the bezel what it is is kind of like a clip on clip on bezel with the double sided tape onto it so what you need to do is to get a metal prying tool or the plastic ones go ahead and get in between the LCD and the bezel and start prying it up so when you pry it up you can hear something like cracking your knuckle that's how it sounds like uh, that is normal so just go ahead and slowly work your way around it and what you want to do is to break loose from the clipper Okay, so at this point right now, what I'm trying to do is I spend a lot more details at the bottom part here. This is where all the cables are. You try not to break anything at this point. So just be very gentle, work your way around it. And once you have the thing somewhat ready to come pop up, go ahead and uh, slightly tilt the screen in the back. And this is where you want to dig in the uh, the cover right here okay so once you have the bezel removed and you can see that the screen is ready to uh, is exposed and ready to come out so this is the LCD screen and what you want to do is to get a Phillips screwdriver go ahead and remove the screws there are four screws holding onto the LCD. So there's one on the top right corner here. Top left. Bottom right. Bottom left. So once you remove the four screws, make sure you save the screws and put them aside. What you want to do next is to lift the screen up towards your body so lift it up towards your body and do not yank or break anything because the cable is still connected to it this is a 30 pin connector LCD and is held by a little white translucent tape so make sure you go ahead and uh, kind of remove the tape so once you remove the tape you do see this little metal bracket this is like a clipper so this this um, this metal clipper right here if, I'm not sure if you can see it let me bring it closer to you so this clipper right here is what what you want to do is to make sure it's open flip it up okay is that one is to secure the cable so once you have the clipper open now you can slide this 30 pin connector away from your body so slide it to that direction okay now you have the cable removed and the LCD is free loose and ready to be replaced if you're gonna ask me where you can get the LCD I have the link in the description below click on the link and it will direct you to either Amazon or eBay where you can find the exact same replacement screen and um, and do the repair yourself so but I'd like to point out to you if you're gonna ask me what number should you look for uh, let me see if I can angle it to the angle. Okay, so if you look here, it says N156BGA-EA2. The version of this is C1. Okay, or you can look up for this CN-0JMC9X. That is also one way to look for the uh, 
the LCD screen. All right, so assuming that the new screen arrived, this is the new screen that comes in. Go ahead and reverse the process. So first thing you need to do is to make sure that the clipper is flipped open and then go ahead and slide that 30 pin connector towards your body. So slide it down to your body, right? Towards your body and then get the clipper, clip it down. That is to secure that cable and pull the little tape snuggle tight and tape it down back down that's how you secure the uh, connector cable right there okay so go ahead and flip up the screen align the screen properly and once you have the screen in the right position put the four screws back on once the screws is back on you can go ahead and clip the bezel back on the bezel is very simple to do it you just have to align the bezel in the right position. I will really start off from the bottom here first. So align them in the right position, tuck, tuck it in, and you start pressing it down. And you can hear this little knuckle cracking sound again to clip it down and that's how you install the bezel. Alright, so I hope that the video helps. This is a very simple process to do the screen replacement. I really like to hear your comment below. So please comment and tell me whether the video is helpful for you, whether you are able to replace the cracked screen for yourself. You know, I'm sure you're watching this video because your laptop screen is cracked. And I'll, I hope that this video helps and you were able to get your screen re repaired. So comment below, tell me what you did and I'd like to hear from you. So take care, give me a thumbs up, like the, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Until next time, take care.